Love Circle and today we're reviewing the new pop vinyls that are out by Mattel and they're all six of the new or I guess it's like it's kind of say the core Monster High characters like and the first six. they're available at Target they're $9.99 they're also available on Amazon but I think they're like a dollar more there and the six characters you can get is as Chase pans over is Frankie, Cleo, Claudine, Draculaura, Gulia, and Laguna. Now, they did release pictures. They are going to be releasing six more in the line, like Spectra, Rochelle, I think Venus, Deuce, Twyla, and like one other that I don't remember. But comment if you guys have seen that. I mean, like, honestly, they all look gorgeous, and I can't even wait to get the whole set. So we're only going to take out uh, two out of the box today. Like, the rest I'm going to actually leave in the box for my collection. Robin was nice enough to get me a second Draculaura for Christmas, so actually I'm going to be opening one of those today. So we'll take her out. And we just happen to have this Gulia right <laughs> We have the Gulia open and available. Now if you guys haven't seen these, they're really super adorable. I love the boxes. Like on the front of the boxes, all of them have color coordinated skeletts with mm -hmm. the These characters. are really, really well thought out boxes. Like even the inside of the box has like hearts and skeletts and details. Like if you left them in the box, they display really well. In fact, they might display better. Yeah, I'm definitely leaving my other ones that I have in the box. And like I said, each of the skeletons in the inside of the boxes, the colors coordinate with the character, like purple for Claudine, and like, you know, Gully has red and stuff, so it's really cool. And they're really like, they're not light, but they're not too heavy. Like, I heard it described their weight is like, kind of like a pop figure. When they first came out, I thought they were going to be pop figures, and I was like, wait, that's a different company. <laughs> so and they're just totally different. They're not pop figures, actually. <laughs> But they're made like almost the same material. I think they're probably They're the same. vinyl, but just, you know, pop figures. Have big heads and tiny there's bodies. There's a certain look to a pop figure, where these yeah. are just vinyl. No, you're speaking of this <laughs> And I love their hair. I like how they all, it seems to stand up by their hair. Like one thing, because Kara bought a couple, and when she was displaying hers, like they actually stand up with their hair. Because their mm -hmm. hair is so long, it helps them to stand up with it. So I thought that was a really cool cute detail that their hair is so elaborate that it's a part of them standing up. It reminds me of those like old 90s Barbie McDonald's toys where they were like the plastic, not vinyl, but like plastic and it's like their dress made them stand up or even I think there's a couple that their hair would be part of like oh, so yeah. you could stand I them. I have a million of them and I need to shoot a collection video of that one day because I was so, so addicted yeah, to those back in the day. <laughs> and now they don't make them the same way. Yeah, they're not as good. They well, yeah, let's, uh, be better. let's show them all. Let's show at least the ones in the boxes off one by one, so they can at least. Since we're not going to take them all out, yeah. show at least show everyone. Here, we'll start off with Claudine because she's right in the middle. So let me know if you need me to tilt it or no, That's actually perfect right there. Oh, I knew that. <laughs> and as you guys can see, like I said, the boxes are coordinated with the color with her. So the skeleton is purple, and the inside of the interior of the box is purple as well. And she's wearing. Oh, and that's another thing too. All these, they're wearing their first wave outfits. So it's like their standard outfit, so it's really well done. And then the back also has a plastic piece that you can see the back of her. And I like that. I like how they're showing off, like their hair is so well done in these because it's like molded together that they're showing it off. And then the side of the box has sketched art of her with the name. And then the other side, it's going to be kind of hard to tell. It's black, like matte and glossy, but it has a sketched picture of her in the box. They're really cute. Yeah. And then mm. let's go to Cleo. Cleo has a yellow box with the yellow skelet around. And then same way, first wave outfit. And then on the back here, I'll flip it over so you guys can see. Has her gorgeous long hair with the gold highlights. And then sketched out a picture of her doing her little cool pyramid pose. And that's the thing about her figure, she's actually walking like an Egyptian, like the song. So cute. So good. And when I saw the pictures of these originally, I thought they were going to be much bigger, but I'm glad that they're small. They're much easier, like Rob was saying, to display. So we got here Frankie with a blue skull and blue interior box. I like her. She's probably like, you know, like one of my other favorites on this. Because y'all flip, flip it on the back, it looks like she's wearing a dress made of black and white in the back. It's just like flowing. Cruella de Bill. Kind of like Cruella de Bill, kind of skinny. I don't know if I can see that. Really so cute. Oh, they made their eyes too really adorable. Like they're kind of like, I don't know how to describe it. Like, like see how they're like anime. -esque. Very anime like. Yeah. Yeah, with the, the Japanese show. Yeah, there is a Japanese anime. 
you watch it? Yeah, they don't have English subtitles though, so it's hard to watch. But it's really It's cute. not hard to watch, you just don't know what they're saying. Yeah, like you don't know what that's I meant. I like how they make them more like monster risk, like how Jackie Laura is actually affected by the sun compared to the like the American uh, one where she's like always running around so in sunlight. Just the characters a little bit on the Japanese anime. And and like, look, you look can watch like them. And so the much the ones I've seen so far like the episodes I've seen so far were like Laguna, how she's always like in a bathtub, even in like the middle of the hallway. <laughs> I know, it's so random. But here's Laguna, and I love, oh, she looks like a mermaid. I think she's really, yeah, cute. She has a beautiful like green teal like color, which matches my nails, <laughs> uh, around the box at the interior as well. And then here, let me show you the back. Look at her hair. Like, it looks like she's wearing like, it looks like sea foam, like coral or something. And I, I love that they have her freckles. That's like oh, one of my favorite things. Can you get a detail of this on the front? About Laguna is her freckles. She just looks so cute. Yeah, it says, let's see, you gotta bring it closer to your camera. I can't see. I don't know if you can see that. She actually has her detailed freckles. And I like how her faces have like a little like cute chubby cheeks on yeah, all of them. Yeah, I see them. it. Cool. So they're like so kawaii looking. They're so cute. And then... The other boxes are next to the Robin. Oh, cool. We'll show the boxes. Even though I have Gulia and Dracula are out of the box. But... Oh, I have my Dracula up there. Uh, Gulia's gonna have the red lining with the red interior. I like her. Gosh, she looks so cute. Lacey, you need this. <laughs> but I really like this a lot. This one's in. Like, here's the back to it. Chase stepping on things. <laughs> and here's the side of the box. Oh, I love it. And look at the. I don't know if you can see. Can you see this one? Like, look at that pose. Yeah, She's here, getting a little tilt shoulder. it up a little bit. No, up. Right there. She's, She's getting yeah. a little shoulder on there. Like, I love that face she has. It's so cute. Showing some sass. And then Dracula is, of course, pink with the pink interior. But I love the sketch art on these. Like, it's so well done. And I love the pigtails. Like, the little swirls at the end popping out. Uh, so let me know, have you guys been able to find these? Now, like, the last couple times I went, they've been out all the time. <laughs> So I'm really glad. Hopefully you guys can find them. Yeah, they've been a lot of our targets have been carrying us. So they're, you know, it's not hard to find anymore. They're pretty easy, especially and if you live in. You said someone found a Spectra, which I didn't even know was. Oh, I didn't mean the Spectra vinyl figure. I meant the Spectra haunted. Oh, he got me excited. He got me so excited. He's like, oh, I found them. someone found the Spectra. I'm like, what? <laughs> okay, but they should be coming out soon. And. <laughs> But here they are out of box. Like I said, they're very, very, very detailed, very well painted. I even like how they had put fishnets on her too. Like, it's cute. I love these. And they're not poseable, but her arm moves up and down. Like it doesn't stay. But oh, but they're kind of like they have some... A different. rubber, yeah. Oh, like, like their body's hard, but their arms are rubbery. Hmm. Yeah. So Probably just because the amount of product. Plastic. Yeah. Well, whatever you can do this way. Mm -hmm. Oh, and I like the glasses rubbery too. I mean, again, every the, all the details on these are just so fantastic. So, leave in the comment below. What do you guys think? I like how they're branching out away from dolls, and they're doing figures too. It's all which that I mean, they have plushies, which I bought some of the plushies in the past, and which I hope they bring back some of the small plushies and the big plushies. Um, but I like it. I like how they're venturing out and trying something different. So I can't wait to get the rest of them. So as always, check out our Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And if you're not subscribed, subscribe. We post videos every single day. And I hope this wasn't too much rambling. But like I said, let us know what you guys think of the Monster High vinyl figures. I love them. <laughs>